All right, here with Michael B. Jordan inside the uh, City Athletic Boxing Club. Uh, filming just wrapped up. Creed three, how'd it go? It went very well. You know, I'm gonna knock out. Uh, what's his name? Drago. 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 Yeah. Yeah. Yvonne Drago. I'm gonna knock him out again. You know, I haven't seen any of the Creeds. But I haven't either. I saw Rocky six or seven, whatever. But I haven't seen a Creed. I don't think if you're in boxing, you can watch Creed. That's really what it is. Yeah. Well, Stitches was in Creed, man. Stitch got money to get being Creed. <laughs> I don't think Stitch was gonna watch Creed for free. So. All right, no, I'll, uh, let me pronounce your name here right. Mussin Kaysen. Yeah, Mussin Kaysen, that's what I said. All right, Mussin. Uh, first of all, let's talk about you, man. This has uh, kind of changed you a little bit. You've been here in camp with KSI for the last couple weeks as he's come to LA, I mean to Las Vegas. Uh, what's it been like for you? Um, as far as getting more publicity for my boxing, it's been really well. Um, I appreciate KSI. Shout out to Amir Abdullah for uh, bringing me in. Pronounce it wrong. Amir? Amir Abdullah. Amir Abdullah. Abdullah. No, no, Abdullah. I've known him for a couple of years. It's Abdullah. I know Arabic. It's Abdullah. Well, he doesn't say Abdullah, so... You know, you just gotta get these guys' name right. If you're gonna do this, you gotta get the names right. Amr Abdullah. <laughs> Sorry, Amr. Amr Abdullah. Amir. But I appreciate Amir Abdullah for uh, bringing me in. He didn't have to, so I really appreciate him. KSI's been doing very well. Um, he's learning from me. You know, anything I can do to help. But um, as far as, you know, getting out there, being known, I appreciate everything that you guys have done for me. What's it like getting a whole new. Uh type of fan you know this is a, a different fan base for KSI a lot of them aren't, aren't boxing fans necessarily so you've been interacting with a lot of people that are KSI fans not necessarily boxing fans how, how was that uh, it's fun it's fun you get a lot of new people there asking asking a lot of uh, novice questions so um, it's interesting but um, you know it's uh, humbling you know you get all those followers and then you know you got to know what to do in order to keep the attention going so I'm learning and so, as far as professionally, you know, you're you're five and zero, a talented boxer by uh, by any means, and you know, you come from a great boxing family. Uh, does this elevate you anywhere? Does it put your name out there more and give you more opportunities? You think? Uh, I think it will eventually. Right now, uh, my brother Hasim Rahman is uh, really pushing me towards making sure that um, my record is perfect by the time I get up there. He's building my record up, and by the time I get there, I think I'll be a, a polished. Um, publicized figure for boxing. All right, you're, you're one of the many uh, fighters that have been knocked out in this training camp. What's it like uh, feeling that power from KSI? KSI got a lot of power. So uh, I know Logan's going down. I know I got a chin. So I know Logan's going to be down for the count, maybe in the second round, I'm going to say. So what was it like when he knocked you out? Uh, I don't know. If you don't I, remember it, right? No, 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 no. I, I think it was in his dreams. <laughs> but, you know, no offense to KSI, love you to death, brother. But uh, you know, I made I'm the only person that did get knocked out, so that was pretty good. But no, he has a lot of power, and I, I, I you got to respect his power, even though he's a novice in the sport. You still got to respect his power, and he's learning very fast. All of us from the outside, you know, you've been inside the ring with him. Uh, we've noticed a great change in just these couple of weeks. What what have you noticed from his swagger to his actual technical abil technical ability in these two weeks? Now I've noticed his confidence, his his swag, his confidence. Is there um, his demeanor, his his approach when he comes in the ring, his presence, it's all there. So he's getting that boxing presence when he comes in the ring, and he's confident. So he's calm, he's uh, more relaxed, and he's uh, a whole lot better. All right. So, so in all honesty, here, what were your thoughts when you first got here working with him to right now? As far as I mean, I know you don't work with Logan, and you, you know you've only seen footage of him, but how did you feel his chances were coming in, and what do you feel like right now? Um, at first, I thought his chances were just like, oh, this is going to be a phony fight, you know, just whack fight. But now that I've been in there with, with him a couple times and I've seen what he's what he's capable of, now nah, this is going to be a hell of a fight. This is going to be a heck of a fight. And inshallah, he gets, uh, gets that knockout. And you've actually uh, studied Logan, right? A little bit of the footage that you had available to you to try to, to replicate that when you got in there? Very uh, robotic, stiff, a lot of muscle. So... KSI is 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 a lot more loose. He's gonna get to him, and that win is will definitely go out. All right, man. Looking forward to it. My man, appreciate it. All right, I appreciate it.